Ever wondered where the gamma function came from? Buckle up, because we're diving into the 18th century, when math was about to be revolutionized by one genius mind. The journey begins with mathematicians scratching their heads over a little issue, the factorial function. You know, that nifty trick for multiplying a series of decreasing positive integers. But there was a catch. It only worked for non-negative integers. Enter Daniel Bernoulli and his quest for a function that could work not only for integers, but also for real and complex values. This is where the magic starts. And then, in strides Leonhard Euler, around 1729, with a groundbreaking idea. Using an improper integral, yeah, the one that calculates the area under a curve stretching infinitely, Euler crafted something extraordinary. He found a way to fill in the gaps between integer factors. Euler's gamma function was born. He didn't stop there. Euler dug deep into its properties, establishing theorems and showcasing its power across probability theory, complex analysis, and even physics. But the story doesn't end with Euler. Mathematicians like Carl Friedrich Gauss took the baton, refining and extending the gamma function's properties. They cemented its place as a formidable mathematical tool. Fast forward to today, and the gamma function stands tall in the world of mathematics. It's crucial for tackling problems involving non-integer analogies of factors. So there you have it. The gamma function is a testament to the ingenuity and daring of mathematicians like Euler and Bernoulli, who pushed beyond the known boundaries and explored the vast landscape of mathematics. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more mathematical adventures.